I, I don't know that we can, you know, unless we go to Pat's house and look at his TV that he's got, you know, we can duplicate the size of the screen in the middle of the field. Um, things that stand out, obviously, uh, defensively, um, really the way they forced their opponents uh, to lose on first and second down. I think uh, third and seven to 10 and third and 11 plus reels, uh, there were a lot of, lot of plays on them, which tells us uh, that they do a great job getting you into uncomfortable situations uh, and behind the sticks. And that's something we're gonna have to be conscious of is, is trying to stay ahead of the sticks in, in what we're gonna do. They do an outstanding job on, on offense, uh, shifting, motioning, uh, creating edges, um, doing some things that way. I think their quarterback play, he does a really good job, and they've done a good job uh, limiting what he does and, and yet uh, being accurate with his throws and not giving the ball up. You know, our special teams, we've got to take advantage of our specialists and uh, not only the guys that are doing the kicking, but, but we've got to create some field position uh, in the return game when given the opportunity. Yeah, we've got uh, obviously having Brandon Powell, who's, who's done it, and Dre Massey, who was actually our guy a year ago before he got hurt uh, in the opening play of the game. Um, but those two guys will handle, handle some of that. Uh, and then obviously in the kickoff return game, um, you know, Tyree Cleveland has done a really good job. And, and we've got a rookie back there that can run pretty fast that we'll let him have a shot if needed to. You know, the quarterback situation, we, we have a plan. Uh, it's in place. No, Edgar, I'm not going to tell you what it is, so there's no reason to ask. But uh, um, we're excited about that. And, uh, and um, yeah, we'll, we'll leave that for them to guess as well. I tell you what we're going to do. We're going to snap it. That, that's the first play. So I, I'm going to let you know a hint. We're going to open up in Wildcat with Kadarius Tony there. How's that? All right. So there you go. All right. There's your starter. Uh, I think the big key to us is going to be how we handle what they do up front. As you know, I, I like our offensive line. I like where we're at. But to me, that's going to be the, tell, the telltale of, of everything that we do. I think we were physically dominated the last time we played this team. And, and I think in the games that, that we've struggled in, it's because up front we've been, we've been whooped. And, uh, you know, for us, uh, I think it's important, you know, that those guys understand that. And, and as I said, I think not letting the previous play affect what you do on the next play. I think, to me, that's probably the big thing. You know, no matter what, you're, you're going to get beat at some point. You know, no one's played the perfect game, but the teams that are really successful, the players that are really successful have short memories. They learn from it, but then they move ahead to the next play. And I think them understanding that, you know, each play is an individual event. And uh, what you got to do is you got to win more of those individual events than your opponent does. And that usually gives you a pretty good chance to win.